This week is National Firefighter Safety Stand Down Week, a time for emergency workers to check in and look at their physical and mental health. Firefighters have to deal with the obvious dangers of their jobs, but just because the fire is out doesn't mean that the danger is over. First News reporter Desiree Gosselin has more on the risk of cancer and PTSD that firefighters face. Ohio has had a firefighter cancer law in place since 2017, but what other kinds of protections are available on these trucks? Well, I stopped by Green Township's fire department to find out exactly what kind of protections firefighters have. These can only be in service for 10 years. Fire protection is more than just helmets and hoses. The gear and the equipment has changed a lot. Fire Chief Todd Baird has fought thousands of fires during his more than 30 years of service. He's seen firsthand how the job wears on firefighters. There were some older guys here that, that did get cancer, and there was nothing around at the time. According to the CDC, firefighters are more likely to get digestive, oral, respiratory, and urinary cancer than civilians. Younger firemen get prostate cancer earlier in life on average. We've had increased awareness over the last five years. Uh, any fire that we go on, whether it's a vehicle fire or anything, firefighters are required to uh, clean their gear when they get back here. The longer and more often a firefighter is exposed to the cancer-causing chemicals from the fire, the more danger they have of getting cancer. After the fire, shower within the hour. Uh, get those contam contaminants off of you as quickly as what you can. Those carcinogens can stick around even after one cleaning. The day after or maybe two days after you were in a working structure fire, when you take a shower, do you smell smoke? And just about everybody says yes. So my reply to that is, why is that still coming out of your body? Green Township Fire Department keeps a decontamination bucket on the trucks to use at a fire scene and installed a shower at the station within the last year. Most research to do with firefighters and cancer has concentrated on men, but early studies have shown that breast cancer can be higher in female firefighters. Reporting in Green Township, Desiree Gosselin, WKBN 27 First News.